In mathematics, differential algebraic equations are a general form of differential equations for vector-valued functions x in one independent variable t, where as a vector of dependent variables and the system has as many equations. They are distinct from ordinary differential equation in that of day is not completely solvable for the derivatives of all components of the function x because these may not all appear. Technically the distinction between an implicit ODE system that may be rendered explicit and a day system is that the Jacobian matrix is a singular matrix for a day system. This distinction between nodes and DAEs is made because DAEs have different characteristics and are generally more difficult to solve. In practical terms, the distinction between DAEs and ODEs is often that the solution of a day system depends on the derivatives of the input signal and not just the signal itself as in the case of ODEs. This issue is commonly encountered in systems with hysteresis, such as the Schmidt trigger. This difference is more clearly visible if the system may be rewritten so that instead of x we consider a pair of vectors of dependent variables and the day has the form where and a day system of this form is called semi-explicit. Every solution of the second half g of the equation defines a unique direction for x via the first half f of the equations, while the direction for y is arbitrary. But not every point is a solution of g. The variables in x and the first half f of the equations get the attribute differential. The components of y and the second half g of the equations are called the algebraic variables or equations of the system. The term algebraic in the context of DAEs only means free of derivatives and is not related to algebra. The solution of a day consists of two parts. First the search for consistent initial values and second the computation of a trajectory. To find consistent initial values it is often necessary to consider the derivatives of some of the component functions of the day. The highest order of a derivative that is necessary in this process is called the differentiation index. The equations derived in computing the index and consistent initial values may also be of use in the computation of the trajectory. A semi-explicit day system can be converted to an implicit one by decreasing the differentiation index by one, and vice versa. Other forms of DAEs the distinction of DAEs to ODEs becomes apparent if some of the dependent variables occur without their derivatives. The vector of dependent variables may then be written as pair in the system of differential equations of the day appears in the form where a vector in a dependent variables for which derivatives are present. A vector in a dependent variables for which no derivatives are present. A scalar is an independent variable is a vector of functions that involve subsets these variables and derivatives. As a whole, the set of DAEs is a function initial conditions must be a solution of the system of equations of the form examples. The pendulum in Cartesian coordinates with center in and length L has the Euler-Lagrange equations where is a Lagrange multiplier. The momentum variables U and V should be constrained by the law of conservation of energy and the direction should point along the circle. Neither condition is explicit in those equations. Differentiation of the last equation leads to restricting the direction of motion to the tangent of the circle. The next derivative of this equation implies and the derivative of that last identity simplifies to which implicitly implies the conservation of energy since after integration the constant is the sum of kinetic and potential energy. To obtain unique derivative values for all dependent variables the last equation was three times differentiated. This gives a differentiation index of 3, which is typical for constrained mechanical systems. If initial values are assigned for y are given, the other variables are determined via and if then and to proceed to the next point it is sufficient to get the derivatives of x and u, that is, the system to solve is now this is a semi-explicit day of index 1. Another set of similar equations may be obtained starting from an assign for x. DAEs also naturally occur in the modeling of circuits with nonlinear devices. 
Modified nodal analysis employing DAEs is used for example in the ubiquitous SPICE family of numeric SIRCAT simulators. Similarly, Fraunhofer's analog and sides Mathematica package can be used to derive DAEs from a net list and then simplify or even solve the equations symbolically. In some cases, it is worth noting that the index of a day can be made arbitrarily high by cascading, coupling via capacitors operational amplifiers with positive feedback. Semi-explicit day of index 1. Day of the former called semi-explicit. The index 1 property requires that G is solvable for Y. In other words, the differentiation index is 1 if by differentiation of the algebraic equations for T an implicit ODE system results, which is solvable for if every sufficiently smooth day is almost everywhere reducible to this semi-explicit index 1 form. Numerical treatment of day in applications. Two major problems in the solution of DAEs or index reduction and consistent initial conditions. Most numerical solvers require ordinary differential equations and algebraic equations of the form it is a non-trivial task to convert arbitrary day systems into odes for solution by pure ODE solvers. Techniques which can be employed include Pantelide's algorithm and dummy derivative index reduction method. Alternatively, a direct solution of high-index DAEs with inconsistent initial conditions is also possible. This solution approach involves a transformation of the derivative elements through orthogonal collocation on finite elements or direct transcription into algebraic expressions. This allows DAEs of any index to be solved without rearrangement in the open equation form once the model has been converted to algebraic equation form. It is solvable by large-scale nonlinear programming solvers. Tractability Several measures of DAE's tractability in terms of numerical methods have developed, such as differentiation index, perturbation index, Tractability index, geometric index, and the Kronecker index. Structural analysis for DAEs. We use the method to analyze a day. We construct for the day a signature matrix, where each row corresponds to each equation and each column corresponds to each variable. The entry in position is, which denotes the highest order of derivative to which occurs in, or if does not occur in. For the pendulum day above, the variables are 